The Holly Dickens Festival wrapping up in Holly this weekend. This year's festival was a little different as it took place in the shadow of the Holly Hotel. The village's historic landmark suffered heavy damage due to a fire that broke out earlier this year. 7 Action News reporter Faraz Javid spoke to some businesses in town about what it means to the community to come together around the holidays after a traumatic year. The annual holiday tradition continued in downtown Holly as folks attended the Holly Dickens Festival. It brings people in from all over southeast Michigan. Linda Stauffer started Battle Alley Coffee four years ago, and since then the festival has played a major role in growing her business. People that come in to shop, they want to support small businesses instead of going to the big box stores. You can find things here that you can't find in other, you know, shops. From Christmas carols on the streets to loads of snacking options to even photo ops at Scrooge. There's so much to love about the oldest, longest running Dickens Festival in the country. Right here in the Battle Alley is where you'll find the Dickens Festival. Right behind me is the Holly Dickens Festival entertainment stage. And just a couple of feet away from the stage is the Holly Hotel. Sadly, a stark reminder of that tragic day. It was very, very scary. On the afternoon of June 21st, a massive fire broke out in downtown Holly. The Holly Hotel was one of the buildings in the area that caught fire. Fire crews from 17 different departments responded to the scene. While no major injuries were reported, several firefighters were hospitalized due to heat exhaustion. It was so windy that day. And had it just shifted a little bit, it would have come this way and taken out this block as well. Dave and Andrea Dinsta's homemade craft booth is right opposite the Holly Hotel. And the couple says most people stop here to remember the fateful day. It's a daily reminder of you know what's happened, but also uh, kind of a, even a forward look of you know how we're going to move forward from you know the, the tragedy. And that's how the Holly community stands out as they continue to support as well as cherish memories of Battle Alley. Everyone's kind of come together as a, as a community, and then uh, looking forward to um, you know everything coming back to normal and then continuing on even stronger than ever. Now, even though the festival is taking place amongst the remnants of the Holly Hotel, folks here say it's a great reminder of how resilient the community is and another reason to come out and support local businesses. Reporting in Holly, I'm Faraz Javid, 7 Action News.